Hi everyone, welcome back. Now I gotta make it through this section. That I thought was a running section, but it is not a running section. So annoying. sure there was some place I had to stick a key card into. This section's a pain in the butt, too.
need to get in there. Haven't had no alien in the vent yet. I guess it's good. Oh, God damn, I didn't know where you were coming from. <sighs> All righty. Let's grab you. required. Dude, go away. Dude, seriously. Go away. He's just stuck there. Not sure where to go.
Okay. Always killed me so many times. Ooh. Holy shit. Oh, I don't know if that was scripted or not, or just bad luck. Restart the generator. Over there in the corner. I don't know if this is going to block line of sight or not. This is not the generator. God damn it. You want me to go all the way back? some more flamethrower juice. Save, save, baby, save. I guess we're just going in here. Drop 
on the tow platform below your space flight terminal. We can take survivors. Ooh, come on. Oh. I remember the last time I played this game, that section was a pain in the butt. Especially running down that hallway because it can the alien can see you through the glass. And so it'll go running out of the room, down the hallway, and get you. It happened to me many times. Even trapped me in the vent once. That's why I was hesitant about using the, the vent. And just circling around the chairs. That's like the better option. Oh, thank God, and a save station. Evacuate station. This is not a drill. I'm curious. I don't know if I've ever been in this room. Actually had a good reward with it. Ow, got too close to the fire. Once we get off this station, we don't ever plan to be back. Never, ever. I read you. I read you. I'm going to try to squeeze past you the best I could.
Where? Restore power. Second one going. That's two. That should be enough, right? This way. Come on. God damn. Initializing docking clamps. Relay, Perfect. the docking clamps are engaging. Straight ahead. Relay, there is no personnel umbilical. It's long gone. What? Wait, I think I can use the maintenance rig instead. If I can find an EVA suit, I can still get to you. Be careful, Ripley. I just know there's going to be an alien. That bit finally decided to show up. Where was my last save? Where was my last save?
I did not know there were two of them wandering around. Verlaine, can you hear me? Are you close enough for radio contact? I'm here! Do this all again. Second one. Okay, gotta go back to the other computer. around this dude. You still got me. How? Oh, I was taking a wide berth around you. Come on. some flamethrower juice. That's what I really want. Did I missed this the first time. Really went there right is by no it. personnel umbilical. It's long gone. Wait, I think I can use the maintenance ring instead. If I can find an EVA suit, I can still get to you. Be careful, Ripley. That's it. Flamethrower field, yes. I just keep following the alien. Hopefully he won't loop back or nothing. Well, you can actually see there's two of them. Bam.
Where are you going, dude? I know you want to come in here after me. I know you do. Oh, goddamn. Came in behind me. Can I save? Can I save? Can I save? Yes, I did. All right. I forgot about that. Right as soon as it was about to happen, I remember. Ah, <gasps> oh, wake up in the nest. Do I still have my stuff? Because this one needs to die. That one too. Oh, 
Oh, face hugger galore. I always die in this section. And it's these damn face huggers. There you go. Now there's always one that wants to sneak up behind you. That one almost made it through. Almost. And it's like I hit it straight on, too. Ooh, boy. you just turn around and look at me like that and I could not back up I was trying it would not let me Maybe not stand up. <laughs> Girl, get up. I know you're tired. I'd be tired too, but we need to get the hell out of here. really close. direction. No idea where that vent takes me. That's where I gotta go. That door's a no-go. Oh, yes. Come on, baby. Where are you at? Oh, 
Okay. Okay. I shot it with the fire. I shot it. It should have died. Now I gotta go. Oh good, it's saved right here. There was two of them. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> oh, climb down. Okay. I was confused by what was going on. And I'm almost out of flamethrower. <laughs> Oh my god. You got so lucky. Oh god damn. It's one goddamn thing after the another. Won't let you down. Oh. Isn't this where I need to be? You don't like that suit. You want to go for the other suit. Okay, whatever. Just put it on and let's go. And there's the airlock. Space suit. Uh, 
Oh yeah, climb. Oh, we're almost there. Can we just release the torrents and just jump out in space and hope we land on the ship? Because I really don't want to go back in there. randomly pushing buttons. Two more, two more. We're all good. It's just a party up in here, ain't it? Are we going to make it back onto the ship? Please. What's funny is I actually don't remember how this ends. Like, I know she's, she's alive. I know that. But outside of that, I don't really remember. Berlaine, I'm on my way up to the bridge. There we go. I can't get out of the suit. Berlaine? 
Oh, god damn. Oh! <laughs> I missed the frog. Oh! Oh. Relaine, I'm I on my way up to the bridge. straight up missed it. I was just more stunned that the alien was there. Relaine? Yeah, when that left prop came up, I pushed right. But as I pushed right, I realized my mistake. I thought we survived. ZX4086. Oh my god. I could have swore we survived. We'll, we will have to wait for the cutscenes. Or not the cutscene, but the end of the credits. To see if there's more to it. Because I could have swore we survived. The Torns or someone finds us. God, th yeah, th this is such a great game. Every time I play it. I, I love it. I wish I could played it. I could have played this when it first came out, but I couldn't. I didn't have a computer or any kind of console. So I just had to stick with watching other people play it. But I made a note. I was like, when this game comes out or when I get some money or something, a new console. I was going to play it. And then when it came out on the Switch, uh, yeah, I downloaded it immediately and played it. Because I think when I first watched it play, it, it was probably 2014 when it first came out. And then it was like four or five years later, it came out on the Switch. And then I played it. And I played medium, and then I immediately turned around and played hard mode. And since then, I have not, not played it at all. This is the first time in quite a few years. A good four, five, six years, something like that, since I played this. Ah, oh, I still love it. Love this game. It's so well done. And hard mode really wasn't that difficult. I was really worried about what I was going to make it through on hard mode. I'm not even really going to, I'm not going to bother doing Nightmare. I think if you're good passing it on hard mode, you're good. There's only one other gamer that I've watched and pass on Nightmare mode. And that was Gab Smulders. She, she actually did it. First time I watched her play, I think it was hard mode. And then the second time was Nightmare mode. God, I wish they would do another game like this. I mean, it doesn't even have to follow like Amanda Ripley or Ellen Ripley or anything like that. Just another space station, another Xenomorph colony, and that'd be so good because all the other games that take place in this whole alien universe, they just aren't that great. Oh, so good.
that's it? I could have swore there was an end scene where some lights lit up and hit her, but hmm. I don't know. I'll have to look that up. But alright, well, if you enjoyed the game, be sure to leave a like, be sure to subscribe. Not sure what kind of game I'm going to do next, but thanks for joining me on this journey through Alien Isolation, and I will see you next time.